So it's been quite some time since we've heard from Jeff Shee all the way back in August, I think, really before the season started, where he was talking about the possibility of a new ground and, and 50,000 seats of stadium for the Wolves. But he's been back in the press today talking to the Sunday Times and then it's been re-reported by the Birmingham Mail and it seems like he's just reiterating the same points that he's made in the past. Where the ambition for Wolves is to win the league in the next few years. There's a broad plan that it will be in the next seven years or so, but the ambition from Fosin is to confirm Wolves as one of the elite teams in English football. There is also mention of a new stadium as well, perhaps hinting at it being started uh, to be built at the end of the season. I think that all depends on when Wolves confirm mathematically their safety in the Premier League. And if that happens anytime soon, we could see development starting at any point. I think it's hinted at there being a new ground being built rather than developing the current ground. Now that doesn't mean necessarily that we could be moving away from Molyneux. There are some rumours that Wolves have already purchased the land that Asda own over there uh, and Wolves could be doing a sort of similar thing to Tottenham which is another thing that's been mentioned in this interview is that Jeff Shee has been really impressed by the work of Daniel Levy at Spurs in that they've invested heavily in their academy and they've been able to bring through players and sell a profit or include in their matchday team on a regular basis like Harry Kane and Harry Winks and then also not spend multi-multi-millions on players like Manchester City have done in recent years as well. So all very positive from Jeff Shee and nothing out of the ordinary but I think more things to be excited about with the Wolves and hopefully in the next couple of weeks we'll see a bit of investment coming into the team uh, and improve that mid-table standing that we've got at the moment and push on for a top seven finish if we possibly could. It looks like the top six is out of reach really with uh, Manchester United suddenly finding their feet with uh, Solskjaer but uh, all we can do is keep on winning our games and worry about our results and of course Manchester City tomorrow night, a big game and Wolves go into it with no fear at all and hopefully we'll get some sort of result before a really, really good run of fixtures up to mid-March before we play Chelsea at the bridge. Anyway, thank you for watching today's video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and check back tomorrow for a review of the game against Manchester City. Bye-bye.